Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Naisha if you're new here. And in today's video, I'm gonna tell you 10 things that I recommend you pick up in the Ulta 21 Days of Beauty sale. Depending on how long that takes me, I might also tell you 10 things that I plan to pick up in the sale. Let's be honest. I would probably pick up more than 10 things, but these are the 10 things that I know right now that I definitely want to get. So if you don't know, the Ulta 21 Days of Beauty is a sale event that they have twice a year in the spring and then again in the fall. And it is three weeks of sales. Every day is a different promotion. They put a couple items 50% off. Normally, there are a lot of products that they put the 30, 40% off throughout the extent of the sale, but I haven't seen those. And usually there's a buy two, get one free with little minis. I haven't seen those either, but I haven't made it into the store. So I don't know if there's gonna be something different when I get into the store. Also, I feel like the calendar and all the information came out pretty late. So I'm not sure if they're just now getting their, their act together in time for the sale. So maybe we'll see that later on. And you know what, if that happens, I'll probably post about it on my Instagram. My Instagram is always linked below, follow me. Speaking of Instagram, this look is going to be up on my Instagram. It is a look with the Pure X Barbie Round 2 palette, the eyeshadow palette and the blush palette. I did a quick look for my Instagram. I'm almost at 5,000, so come on. Go there, follow me. Let's get your girl to 5K. But yeah, today I'm giving you some cozy vibes. It's a little bit chillier today. My last video was nice and warm outside. Today, the, the temperature has dropped back down. We know how spring gets. One minute is warm, one minute is cold. You never know. You go outside with layers. You got to take half of them off by the middle of the day. But that's how spring is. You know, just be prepared. Anyway, I also uploaded a video earlier today. That was my Ulta sale and clearance haul. A couple orders that I made prior to the sale that I wanted to haul and talk about. So that's already up. I'm going to link it if you haven't seen it. If you hear the wind outside, it's it's like a tornado out there. I don't know what is going on today. But yeah, if you're interested in hearing uh, what I recommend that you pick up in the Ulta 21 Days of Beauty sale, please keep on watching. Today is the first day of the sale and I already picked up a couple of things, but I'll let you know that in the second half of the things that I'm gonna get. The first thing I'm gonna suggest that you pick up is not until Wednesday, March 17. It is the Beauty Bakery Flower Powder. A couple of brands that are women founders are going to be on sale. 50% of Beauty Bakery, Mented, Persona and, Persona and Sarah Hap. And out of that bundle, I would recommend the Beauty Bakery Flower Powder. It comes in several different colors. I use Cassava and Plantain, which are the more yellowy ones. And it is one of my absolute favorite setting powders. It is extremely finely milled and when you press it onto your face, it literally sinks into your face. There's barely anything for you to dust off when you're done. It's not cakey, there's no flashback, it leaves everything smooth. If you like a matte finish, I highly, highly recommend that powder. And of course it is $24 and it will be on sale on Wednesday, March 17th for $12. The next product that I suggest you pick up would be the Urban Decay Brow Blade. So it is a waterproof waterproof eyebrow pencil and ink stain. So on one side is a nice thin eyebrow pencil and on the other side is one of those almost like a liquid liner um, inky pencils. And that helps if you have thin brows like me, it helps that pen helps make hair like strokes all along your brows. It gives it a more natural look to it. And there are several colors. I use dark drapes, which is like a dark brown, and it works really well for me, even with my dark hair. It's normally $26, but it's gonna be on sale for $13 on Thursday. The next thing that I recommend is the Sunday Riley Power Couple Mini Kit. This is gonna be on sale on Monday, March 22nd. So what it is, it's a mini kit of the Sunday Riley Good Jeans, which is one of my Holy Grail serums, as well as the Luna Night Oil. That one's okay, not, you know, not my holy grail, but the good jeans, 100% recommend. And this kit is normally $28, it's gonna be on sale for $14. I'm not gonna pick it up, I literally pick this up every year in the sale, that's how I keep up my supply. But in a lot of my boxes, I've been getting the uh, good jeans, so I have two full-size bottles ready to go. So I'm good on that for the minute. 
but like I said, it is really, really good if you have large pores, oily skin. It really, really helps to tighten those pores, clean them out, helps smooth everything out. I really, really enjoy that serum. The next thing that I recommend, well, two things on Tuesday, March 23rd, would be the Ofra highlighters. All of them are going to be 50% off. They range from $35 to $40, so they will be $17.50 to $20. And I'm wearing an Ofra highlighter right now. I think this one is blissful. It's a little bit of a pinky. I tone these down. You see how bright my uh, the center of my face is? I tone these Ofra highlighters down by dusting it off, going over it with the blush. If you like a blinding highlight, you don't even need a lot. You just need a tiny bit on your brush. If you like a blinding highlight, the Ofra highlighters, highly, highly recommend them. So the Line Crime Venus Palace, these are usually on sale every year as well. And they are $38, going to be down to $19. A couple years ago, I picked up the first three Venus one, two, and three. Out of those three, I only have one, so I would definitely suggest the Venus one. Love that nice, warm everyday palette, nice neutrals and warm colors. And the other one I would suggest would be the Prelude Chroma. So it has uh, some richer warm colors, but also some nice greens in there and a really beautiful gold. I picked that one up last year and I was really, really impressed. The Lime Crime formula is not bad at all. It's not my favorite, but it's not bad at all. And I love these smaller curated palettes. The packaging is a little bulky, but they are eight pan palettes and they're nice. They're smaller, uh, easier to think of like, you know, what look you're going to do. The Venus 3 one, the pink one, a lot of people are receiving that in their BoxyCharm right now. I think I might still have it. I'm not sure if I decluttered it, although it wasn't my favorite, but I think I might still have it. So I might do a look with it, but the venus the original venus and the prelude chroma both really good i uh, highly recommend picking up some of these lime crime palettes another staple that i would uh, recommend on wednesday march 24th would be the urban day cosmetics eyeshadow primer so those are regularly 24 dollars on sale for 12. i am using the caffeine which is very very close to my skin tone i use it almost every day and it's not it gives some good coverage and has a little bit of stickiness to it and I feel like it really grabs onto the eyeshadow pigment and it, my eyeshadows last all day and as you can see they're nice and bright and pigmented. Definitely one of my favorites, it's been one of my favorites for years. It's probably one of those that goes on sale every year and for a reason because it's something that I really recommend that people should have in their makeup collection. Another staple product and is basically on sale every year. Now would be a good time to re-up on your Benefit Cosmetics Gimme Brow Tinted Volumizing Eyebrow Gel. My absolute favorite eyebrow gel has such a teeny tiny brush and it just goes perfectly with my very sparse eyebrows. It comes in several colors. It's normally $24 and on Friday, March 26th, it's going to be $12. And I wear number... Number four or five, depending on which one I grab at the time. But those are the two colors that I use. And it also has fibers in it. So it's not just a gel that's going to hold the hairs that you have. It also adds fibers to it to volumize, as it says, the eyebrow. So it actually looks more like hair than just makeup. Trust me, it really transforms your eyebrow. The next thing that I would recommend is the Beauty Blender and Sponge. They have the very new, the very brand new one, the Dreams World Blend and Cleanse Set, normally $20, on sale for $10. Beauty Blender is not my favorite. I don't think you should ever pay $20 for a Beauty Blender. So if you really like Beauty Blender or you want to get one or you want to try it, this would be a good time to get this swirly one. They just come out with different colors you know, every other month. So what's good about this one is it also comes with the cleanser solid. Again, I would never suggest spending a lot of money on those. Literally just use soap. Use an exfoliating soap and cleanse your brushes and your blenders. If you want me to do a how I clean my brushes and my blenders video, I can do that for you. I literally just use soap. And there's an amazing one at Trader Joe's. We can talk about that later. But if you really want a beauty blender, now would be a good time to get it because you get the blender and the soap for just $10. The next thing that I'm going to recommend would be the KKW Lip Liners. 
on Thursday, April 1st, they are going to be 50% off, normally $12. They will be down to $6. These are one of my favorite lip liners. They go on very, very creamy and then dry down matte and they don't budge. It's annoyingly in a like a wooden pencil. You know, I would rather if it was sort of like, like one of those roll ups, so I wouldn't have to sharpen it all the time, but I'm just lazy. That's just me. But the formula and my favorite are the two darker ones. Uh, two and three are perfect nudes for me whenever I'm wearing my nude colors. I absolutely love those liners. And for $6, you know I'm going to grab some up. And I suggest you do too. And the number 10 thing that I would recommend that you pick up in this year's Ulta 21 Days of Beauty sale would be again a staple that goes on sale every year the ABH brow is normally $23 will be on sale for $11.50 now I think it's definitely worth $11.50 $23 they push in it it's a nice brow pencil it is my absolute favorite next to the benefit precisely my brow which usually goes on sale but it's not on sale this year what's up benefit it's one of my absolute favorite brow pencils it nice and thin very pigmented goes on smooth no skipping no tugging so if you need to re-up on some eyebrow pencils the sale brings it down to the price of like a regular drugstore a nyx or a colourpop eyebrow pencil so this would be a good time to get a really good eyebrow pencil for this price and that one's going to be on sale on the last day of the sale which is saturday april 3rd so now that i told you all the things that i suggested you pick up I'm just going to tell you a couple of things that I'm definitely going to get. To be honest, there's going to be more than this, but I'm just going to give you a little sneak peek in what's going to come in my haul. So the first thing I want to mention is today, yes, I did already place an order. I got the Clinique Even Better Clinical Radical Dark Spot Corrector and Interrupter. Now, if that doesn't sound like something you need in your life, I don't know what is. So this one is a diamond and platinum exclusive. Um, so if you're not diamond and platinum, you're not going to have access to it. So they're different sizes. It's regularly $54 to $85. So I got the smaller one, the $54 one half price. So it's $27.25, the one ounce. One ounce is enough for me to try a Ceramont and see if it works. I do have a couple acne um, spots here and there and hyperpigmentation around my mouth the skincare that I've been using recently has really done a really good job to lighten it up but you know I like trying out new things and this is supposed to be really good for uh, helping with dark spots and I don't know about the interrupter part that sounds really really interesting so we got to check that out so I already placed my order for that one and also today they had a beauty steal for the Idole Eau de Parfum from Lancome uh, normally but not the bigger one the smaller size the one ounce the 0.7 ounce size which is normally $59 they had it on sale for $29.50 so I went ahead and grabbed that I've been wanting to try that perfume out for a while I would have preferred to got the regular size but this is the one that's on sale and you know what I don't mind if I really really like it I'll get the bigger size another time the next thing I'm probably going to pick up would be from Peach and Lily so on Monday March 15th they're going to have the matcha pudding antioxidant cream and the wild dew essence treatment on sale and i'm probably going to get the essence i love having an essence in my skincare after you wash and tune your face you go in an essence before you start with the serums and that helps to hydrate your skin and helps the serums absorb even better into your skin and honestly since i've added an essence into my skincare i feel like it really has made a difference so i always make sure to have an essence in my skincare routine right now i'm using the biro one and i have an elf one on standby but i've been hearing a lot of good things about peach and lily so i wanted to try this one out and the full size is 39 dollars. So it's going to be on sale for 19.50 19.50 sometimes my math works out next on tuesday march 16th i saw that they're going to have this i think this is pretty new the cover effects luminous tinted moisturizer and custom application brush honestly at first i thought it was going to be a duo and i was like hell yeah i'm going to get the moisturizer on the brush but no it's separate so i might try out the uh, luminous tinted moisturizer it's normally 39 dollars going to be on sale for 19.50 so i'm going to try that out on wednesday march 17th like i mentioned before 
couple of the women founded brands are going to be 50 percent off that includes mented cosmetics and they have a new line of lip glosses that i definitely want to try out i recently bought one of their bronzers in that ulta haul that i uh posted earlier today and i have a couple of their lipsticks and liners so i want to try one of the glosses and it's really reasonably priced it's normally 15 dollars, and then of course with this is going to be 750 so i'm going to keep an eye on those and try that out the next thing i'm probably going to pick up on saturday march 20th is the this is another diamond and platinum exclusive is the tarte shape tape creamy concealer so the regular shape tape is one of my holy grails i have like three or four backups i don't need any more but they're coming out with a creamy version and i know a lot of people don't like the fact that the shape tape it dries all the way down matte and it probably you know creases under the eye I mean, it doesn't really do anything to me because I prep my eye really well before I use it, before I use any concealer under there. So I absolutely love it and have no problem with it. But they came out with a creamier version, which is almost like a eye cream in a concealer as well. So I definitely want to try that out. So I'll be picking one of those up. This is normally $27. And we'll be on sale for $13.50. More around my price point. I don't think I've ever paid $27 to Shape Tape. I've always bought it on sale. And always will also on march 20th some of the nabla eyeshadow palettes are going to be 50 percent off so i'm gonna i'm gonna check to see which ones and uh, decide which ones i'm gonna get there are two that i'm kind of hemming and hawing between the poison and the secret garden so i'm trying to decide between those they're normally 39 dollars and they'll be on sale for 19.50 i have a couple nabla palettes i have the side by side one the new the neutral one love it and I have the one of the little six pan ones called the Cutie is a deep mauvey burgundy-ish one. Absolutely beautiful. The formula in there is immaculate. Uh, so based on those two palettes that I've used before, I want to try out some more. So I'm just deciding between those two or I might get them both. But you know, you didn't hear that from me. The seventh thing that I might pick up, and this one is also a diamond and platinum exclusive, they will be 50% off the MAC powder blushes, normally $25 for a blush. It'll be down to $12.50 more in my wheelhouse. They have a bunch of different uh, shades that are going to be on sale, but they have some really nice mauve tones there. And uh, it looks like colors that I don't have in my collection. I've really been loving mauve blushes uh, recently, so I might... I'm probably going to pick up one of those. On Monday, March 22nd, I am definitely going to pick up the Pure. The Pure 4-in-1 Love Your Selfie Longwear Foundation and Concealer. Normally $36. It's going to be $18. This range, I think they have like 50 shades. And it's definitely a shade for everyone. It might be a biatch to find your shade because there are going to be so many that are so close. So I'm going to, from now, try, start trying to figure out which shade is mine. So I'm not caught off guard when it's time to get it. I got a couple weeks to figure it out, but knowing me, let me do it now. Else I'm going to forget about it and then be like, 50 shades, I don't know which one is mine. And we have number 9 on ten and 10, both on the same day, Wednesday, March 31st. I'm going to pick up the Urban Decay All Nighter Face Makeup Primer. Normally $36 will be on sale for $18. I got a little sample of this when I bought some stuff from Urban Decay a while back and I really, really enjoyed it. Love that foundation and concealer that I picked up at that time too, but that's a different story. So I'm definitely going to be picking up a full size because I really like how it worked with my foundations. And then also on that same day, I'm going to be getting the Peter Thomas Roth Water Drench Hyaluronic Cloud Cream Hydrating Moisturizer. Normally $52. Will be on sale for $26. Peter Thomas Roth is pretty much up there, but their products are so nice. The packaging is so luxurious. I recently got a toner in the last sale. I got the toner, the cloud toner, and I've really been enjoying it. So I really want to get the cloud moisturizer as well. All right. So that's it. That is 10 things that I recommend you pick up in the Ulta 21 Days of Beauty Sale and 10 things I'm going to pick up in the Ulta 21 Days of Beauty Sale. So let me know.
Are you going to shop the sale? Have you shopped the sale already today? Let me know down in the comments. Which of these things are you going to pick up? Are you excited for the sale? Do you think it's a dud? I'm hearing a lot of people say like, eh, it's a dud. But to me, if it's a lot of the things that are repeating, a lot of the things that are repeated are good, staple products that I use religiously, like the ABH Brow Wiz, the Benefit Gimme Brow, these things, I'm always going to wait for the sale to pick it up. I'm never going to pay full price for those things. One other thing that I saw that I really haven't seen a lot of people mention is, you know, depending on if you're a platinum or diamond, they have a bunch of different opportunities for points. And one of them I'm going to put on the screen. I don't know if this is just a diamond or platinum exclusive or if everyone is going to get this. But basically, over the course of the sale, if you spend $200, it's going to accumulate over the course of the sale. You're going to get a bonus 1000 points. That is an additional $50. So when I saw that, I activated it right away. I was like, hell yeah, I'm going to get that. And then there were a couple others, but that was the one that I felt that was most worth mentioning. So check under your profile and see what point generating opportunities you have. All right, so, you know, I'll be honest. I just told you 10 things, but there's probably going to be uh, some more. So look out for the haul that's soon to come after this sale. I guess in about a month since the sale is going to run for three weeks. If you like these kinds of videos, please give it a thumbs up and thank you so much for watching all the way to the end. Please subscribe if you haven't already and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.